In anticipation of the upcoming remote learning environment, Mesa Public Schools has acquired pre-built content in order to help facilitate online learning. When the school year begins, teachers will have the role of facilitators in these courses. What that means is they will have access to the content and will be able to assign grades. However, they will not be able to alter any of that content. What I'm going to do in this video is talk a little bit about what that content looks like and some getting started basic help directions in order to interact with it. So on this page, you'll notice at the very bottom here, there are two links. This top one here is going to take you to a Google document that will have a list of all the pages and content courses that are going to be created. You can see that they're broken down by their grade level and by the specific subject. In order to access one of them, simply click on the hyperlink and then click on the link that appears below it. This will take you into Canvas and it will load up the Canvas course. In order to navigate around and look at the content, you can do it in two ways. You can click on the modules tab here, which we're currently in, and look at each of the modules with each of the items inside of it. Using the scroll bar on the right hand side, you can scroll through and select different content items and view them. If you'd like, you can also use the next button to move sequentially through the list. If you'd like to return to the modules tab to see maybe the bottom of the list or the middle of the list, Simply click on the Modules button here, and again, use the bar on the right-hand side to scroll through the different content pieces. Now the other item that I want to talk about is located right here. These are the Getting Started directions. So if you click on them, it'll open up another Google document, and in this Google document, it'll also have a link to the course list and tell you exactly what I've spoken about in navigating Canvas. Now inside of the FLVS courses, what you can do is once you pull up a page, let me see if I can find one here for us, you'll be able to navigate that content with the arrows here at the top, and you can use any of these other items on the top here or on the right hand side such as play, pause, and stop. Now I hope this video has been helpful for showing you the FLVA courses, and if you have any questions please contact your online instructional design coach or any EdTech trainer.